Welcome back to another episode of Balling With. Uh, we're going to continue on with the teams and over and under for every NFL team. Today we're looking at Minnesota Vikings. Top right on into their win total. They have them over eight and a half wins. Uh, let's see what they're talking about this season. Um, eight and a half. I think it was on that cusp last year. They won about the same amount. Around the, uh, let's see, about nine, ten games, right? 13. They won 13. I think they definitely fall off from this last year. They, they had a good um, a good campaign of, you know, pulling off the last couple of games. But Justin Jefferson is a dog. Um, let's hop right back into this. They are 8.5, so that's about a four-game drop-off um, to win nine total games. Uh, I think that's doable for the Vikings. I think they do win the division. Uh, it's going to be a tough Division between them, Lions, and Green Bay Packers, uh, and Bears. Uh, but I do think Vikings do have the upper hand. They are Kirk Cousins led and Justin Jefferson. They got another rookie receiver, a couple other guys as well. Um, starting week one, I do think they're going to win that game easily, hands down, versus the Buccaneers. Week two, I think they lose this game. They win this game. That would, you know, tell the testament, but it depends. I think Eagles defense will be too much for the Vikings. And I think the Chargers' offense will be too much for the Vikings as well. I think they start off one, two, then they're gonna look themselves in the mirror and reevaluate themselves, and then come back and finish two and two, uh, two and three. Have a tough beginning part of the schedule, a little bit. Uh, three and three, they're gonna win this game here versus the Bears. Four, three and four right here versus the Packers. Uh, if they're four and four, um. Three and four at this point, playing the Packers. Uh, I think Packers will feel pretty confident, and then this could be a must-win game here for the Vikings. Uh, let's say the Packers win, and they become three and five. And uh, let's continue on. I think they win this game four and five. Uh, I think they can win this game versus the Vikings. I mean, versus the Saints. I might have had them switch flip flop back and forth, but um, this gonna be a close game. If they are in that dire need and need to win that game to get back to five hundred or five and five, I think they do. So. Uh, and I think they win this game, become six and five, and win this game as well, seven and five, uh, and they could win this game as well, eight and five, and they come back on a little half game win streak towards the end. And that's what I can see the Vikings do, and that's how they play. Um, start off a little slow, come off hot in the middle of the season, and eight and five here, and you gotta finish off. You're coming back into the winning division playoff run. Uh, you better win this game. If you don't, you're going to go eight and six. I got them losing. Uh, then now you have these two important games versus the Detroit Lions, eight and six. The Detroit Lions are eight and six. Who's going to win the division? It's a must-win game. Uh, both of these wins. So if you lose, you better win this next one. And you're going to have the Packers. So Vikings have to win. They're six and eight and six here. Eight and six. Eight and six. Uh, I do think they're going to win one of these games as well. Out of these, um, they're going to start off a little slow, come in hot. In the middle of the season, they're gonna win. If they don't they win this one, they're gonna win this one. They're gonna win this one and finish ten and six, I think. They're gonna win more than eight and a half. They're gonna win nine games this season. They, they, their drop off is to nine. So be it. They have thirteen wins. Um, I think the Vikings do win over eight games this season. But guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Uh, Justin Jefferson is the best receiver in the league. Um. No more news, videos, podcasts, uh, highlights, sports bets. Uh, we're going to do um, local videos, highlights for uh, high school students in the community, um, football and basketball for the fall season. Make sure you follow us for the journey. Uh, guys, like, comment, subscribe again, and we'll catch you guys on the next episode.